What is going on guys? Cowboy here, and we are back ready to get kicked off with Freedom of the Press. So, before we start this mission, one thing I noticed now on my way over here is uh, there's a lot of little like subsections now you can see of, uh, you know, by the bladers. And interestingly enough, it seems like anytime you run into one, there's a like rescue target type mission you have to do, so... We haven't done any of them yet, but uh, definitely just a nice new little piece of content they've added in. You know, we didn't really have something like that before. Uh, either way, let's get continuing on here with the next part of Sequence 3. Get some press on what we're doing. Make the people aware. Blast them. Alec, whatever is the matter? I have been intercepting nothing but poppycock propaganda about soothing syrup and whatnot. No, I swear to high heavens, if Starrick's monopoly continues... Alec, I beg your pardon. These are friends of mine. Evie Fry and her brother, Jacob. Oh, oh um... Alexander Graham Bell. Linguist, inventor and technical expert. Alec, I have something of a favor to ask you. Can you fix this? Oh, looks like the casing is cracked. Oh, comes apart. <laughs> I see. Could have used one of these to fit my fuses on top of Big Ben. Alec is installing a new telegraph line for our Free Press Association. To combat the Static Telegraph Company. Now, if I can mend the fuses connecting independent lines from Big Ben, Static will be weakened. Only we are somewhat at a handicap. And there. Oh, I've removed the mechanism, so it may work with your bracer. I'll put it to use immediately. <laughs> Jacob, wait. Mr. Bell, allow me to help you with your fuses. Oh, you will not find me too proud to accept Miss Fry. Oh, uh, we can use my carriage, if you'd be so good as to hold the reins, though. I'll take that. Um, I, I can help you. Nice. Now I have my grappling hook. Oh, Miss Fry, I am so glad you could assist. Do you have new skills you can put on? Maybe. Got two points. Let's see, we're gonna grab you. Um. I mean, it wasn't a huge pain. Um, I'm gonna try and avoid open combat altogether with her. I feel like that would really help her. Let's do this. That'll help more all around, considering I'm making her focus be stealth and not combat. That's one I just can't go wrong with. Hey, you level three. Well, let's take a look. Leadership. Awesome. I can now get more rooks. Gun will reload mid-combo. Collisions inflict less damage and don't slow you down as much. That's nice. I'll probably end up saving up and getting Stealth 2 for her. Ooh, automatically perform knives performing multi-kills. That could be really good for her. Mutilate. That's going to be... Uh, mutilate and Execute have Jacob written all over it. I wish there was a way to, to switch between them while you were at the skills menu, but you know when you hit the button, it swaps up to a new person altogether. And brings you back out. Really ought to be here by now. I'm I'm coming. I'm coming. Relax. So, Mr. Bell, what inventions are you concocting? I intend to develop an intertelegraph telegraph that does not just convey dots and dashes, Miss Fry, but the human voice. Phonetic telegraph. Hmm. Sounds a bit of a mouthful. You could just call it a telephone. Telephone. <laughs> How bizarre. Anyway, as it was saying. God. The race has become entirely dependent on the Static Telegraph Company. Which is why Mr. Green has asked you to set up a free line. Yes. What is more, other small independent companies have had their lines sabotaged. And they have little means of finding any broken fuses, which are... To be found on top of Big Ben. Correct. 
left bumper to ascend from a ledge. Ah. Uh, well, that explains how to get that one thing I couldn't grab earlier. Right, press LB to zip line. Left stick and right trigger to position yourself for air assassination. They will not be a problem. I'll repair the fuses. Oh, come on. Up, Evie, up. There we go. Nice. That's one way to scale a building. Where's the sink point? I think it's up higher. It's probably the very top. Yep. And that other one that I couldn't read. Yeah, we're just about getting to the point for a, uh, a free roam live stream, I think. This is going to be freaking awesome. Oh, nope. Go up, Evie. Come on now. Evie. That's my girl. things. straight across. This might be my best bet. No, this will work. Got it. Very nice. And the zip line really does give like a whole new dynamic of uh, exploring that you couldn't do before. And on top of that, it also provides a uh, an easy transition for when they finally get around to making a like full Assassin's Creed in the modern world. Cause you're gonna need something like this tr to traverse. Like, you wouldn't be able to without it. You know, all the skyscrapers and whatnot. I mean, sure, you might be able to climb it with enough time, but That's the last fuse. That should do it.
going to have to jump down a bit. I was hoping to find a zip line point, but I'm not going to get one from right here. That's right, I came quite a ways up. I'll just drop on down. Uh, yeah, why not? I already got the uh, bonus quest done. Right, much easier to zip from an altitude like this. thought it would be. I don't need to zip line over to there. I wanted to zip line <laughs> most of the way back. It just didn't end up happening. Thank you very much, Miss Fry. I will now be able to continue with the installation of the new line. If there's anything else I can do to help... Uh, certainly. Please do come and visit. Oh, uh, I was toying with this device and have noted down the formula for you. It, it's not perfect yet, but by golly, it works. Something that'll spook horses. I could see that coming in handy. Loot 200 metal components. It's a, is that a quest? Like then again, I guess that uh, a lot of the metal components I've been finding. It seems like you find stuff in in uh, big groupings. And I have no points. I wish there was like an indicator that would show up and you had points that you could spend, that would be pretty nice. Um, I need, I need this. I need this. Whatever, dick. Gimme, give gimme give your carriage.
Uh. No, nothing. God damn it! Jump into the dirty weather, dirty water. I can't even talk. Jump into the dirty weather. I figured I would just use a zip line to jump over to the bridge right there, but clearly that did not work out. This water looks disgusting. I feel like you get diseases just swimming in it. Like, why did that not work when I was on the boat? Pure EV mission. Stop that. Very mean of you. Can't fight. I don't have time for you guys. I'm here to loot stuff. Knock this bitch out, Evie. Man. Tell you what, she is pretty brutal with that cane. Not EV style to fight out in the open. Whoop. It is her style to dip, vanish, and circle back around for a quick assassination in a second here. But like we know she's here. Where is she at? <laughs> God 
Gotcha. You want to fight on the roof? You might get knocked off. Bitch. I think that I can mark treasure chests now. Sneaky. You want me to show you your insides? You're gonna show me my insides? That's not gonna happen. Cause you did. All right. Looks like there is another uh, another chest, maybe, or something. Oh, it's just a hiding spot. That's all. It's weird. Chests usually disappear off the map after you get them. Ooh, there's stuff underground? What? Must be some hidden goodies. <laughs> New gear and tool upgrades. Find unique resources in crafting plants and chests. Income activities, especially robbing cargo from trains, carts, and boats, provide large amounts of resources. What is that item that I'm, like, constantly out of? I, it looks like it's leather. I think it's, like, chemicals, chemicals, cloth, steel, and leather. I like the throwing knives a lot, so we'll upgrade that. Um, smoke bombs I haven't used much, but I'm going to want all the upgrades by the time I get to the end anyway. Oh, nice. And those are the two I had to upgrade. That works. Alright. Now over to Bell's shop real fast. And we'll wrap this one up. Oh no, she stabbed him in the dick. Oh, Evie. Fighting below the belt. Uh, I was just showing Jacob the first message was received via the mended lines. Oh, uh, you can keep the rope launcher, by the way. Um, we've managed to procure another one for your brother. Excellent work. Thank you, again. You're very welcome, Mr. Bell. We can now defend the principle of impartial news and free speech. Free is fair, but free and brief is far better. Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, Fry, such caustic wit. <laughs> And on that note, we must depart. <laughs> oh, uh, good fortune to you both. Uh, call on me at any time. Nice. So with that one done, um, I'm not entirely sure, but I think we might be completely done sequence three. Either way, like I said, we're going to wrap this one up here, and we will have another one for you guys coming later today.